welcome to the latest Newman motor. Let me adjust this. As you saw at the beginning of the video, I had about 147 volts. And right now I'm drawing about about 0 .07, 0 .06 uh, amps. Okay. Now, all right. Now it's drawing 0 .03, 0 .05, 0 .01 amps. You see, it's still moving. So right now, what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to help help this thing. You see all these wires here. Here's the gold. I mean not the gold. Copper and what I have here is the twist ties to keep it stable. I had to add a lot of twist ties uh, on the the rotor, as you can see there. And I actually had to tape this now because this thing shakes like my uh, my smaller motor that I used to have that was made of let's see where is it okay yeah it's right over there uh, this motor here this is my older motor it would shake it, it now shakes just this big one now shakes as much as this and it uses about the same wattage now I'm going to go ahead I'm going to put the fan so that it works better at higher speeds. Okay. Because it keeps on trying to flatten while it, the thing is moving really fast. So as I do that, I'm going to be improving the quality of the fan. Hopefully I can still get to go fast. Now, you can see it's flattened. And because it's so fast, I'll have to uh, figure out some way. Right now, it's using 0.01 to 0.04 amps. Now, make it faster. Depends on how to make it faster. Now, I could, what I could do, is I could, uh, there we go. There we go. There's a small motor there I used to have. This is the big motor. But see, this thing's spinning so fast, I can't even get the wind to be produced very well because it keep, keeps on wanting to slide that way. But we know at least it's fast, and it's probably capable of turning more wind. It's just that the fan blades are, even though I made them bigger, they want to flatten it more. Okay, so hopefully I can do this within 10 minutes. You have to do this. Okay. Hopefully that's good. And we'll go ahead and turn it on. That's here. That's good. It still isn't flattened the way I want it to. But at least it's fast. And if you take 147 volts, multiply it by 0.06 amps, you get about uh, 9 watts right now that it's using. So this motor right now is using about 9 watts. You can see. Can you see the shaking? I'll hold it still.
There we go. You can see the shaking right there. So I added a lot of roller skating, roller skate bearings. As you can see there, roller skate bearings, just a commutator. This thing's got a lot of torque. This thing is spinning way too fast. Look how thin it's going now. I think at some point I'll need to replace this uh, fan. with a, a better wooden one. So that's what I'll be uh, having later. So this is the human motor with 147 volts. There we go. There it is. In the motor.